Hello to the Nation, Dr. PlayStation Nation here, back again for episode 2 of Off Factions, guys. So episode 1 was a longer episode, and I just wanted it to kind of give you guys the feel of it. From now on, we're going to be doing a little bit more edited stuff, or hopefully some more edited stuff. I'm going to go back to my home farm for you guys. Uh, I did some uh, a few hours of work here today, guys, um, and uh, I, I finished the farm. So pretty much this is the farm. Uh, it's going to have all of our, all of our, uh, all of our carrots in it. And as of right now, with the diamond pickaxe that you guys get in tools, you actually get a 55 fortune enchant on it. So with 55 fortune, as you guys can see, I'm a, I have an empty inventory right now. Are you guys ready? Boom, 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 boom. Here we go. Here we go. Whoa, I, I accidentally broke those slabs. That's not a good idea. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. So as you guys can see, just going through that one section, uh, I got almost an entire inventory full of these carrots. So uh, that's pretty cool. That's going to mean that, you know, over the course of this entire thing, we're going to be able to make about $100,000 per yield, which is going to be pretty good. So as of right now, this is, uh, I would say, maybe a little bit OP, maybe a little bit OP, but uh, we definitely will be working on it. So, you know, if, if there will need to be any changes, there they those will be made. But uh, as of right now, this is, this is pretty good. This is pretty good. So anyway, um, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm probably just gonna go through this and start harvesting all of this, uh, all of these carrots here. I just need to be really careful to make sure I don't start breaking the slabs here. But um, ideally, you know, if we end up do, uh, if if we end up do, if we end up uh, taking away the Fortune 55 pick or something like that and replacing it with something else, that it, you know, I might as well just make this automated. I'm probably just gonna make this automated. Oh no, no, no slash back. Uh, chest, give me an empty chest. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. I completely spaced on the fact that uh, Control Q, right? Control Shift. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Slash back. Please no clear lag. There we go. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So, and I'm I'm getting crazy high. Like as you guys can see, boom, my herbalism is going up a lot just from getting all these things. But uh, yeah, Skippy and Starboy aren't going to be here uh, necessarily for every episode either. You know, they're probably going to be here later today when we're getting stuff. And I'm also looking through some some of the applications, guys. So we already have a ton of applications for you know joining the faction and that sort of stuff. So uh, anyway, we're gonna have to figure out a new a new solution for this or something because um, this is not going to work. So yeah, just holding shift and going like that. Thank God I learned that. But uh, anyway, guys, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep on I'm gonna keep on keeping on with this with this right here, and uh, we'll we'll come back when we have all those carrots. Anyway, guys, so. Uh, we just finished building this again, so we didn't just finish we actually wanted them to like spawn in so that we can like Get them and get all the money from them and all that sort of stuff I gotta poke here so let's fix this because the slime just spawned in here and destroyed all of them just before we hit record <laughs> But uh, anyway, so this is the you guys might notice like the walls are different. This place looks nicer It's because we actually like knew what we were doing when we got in here So I left like a little spacing here so that we can automate it as you guys can see, still a kind of a disaster on the bottom. But anyway, um, placed a bunch of torches so things won't spawn in there. But uh, anyway, we needed to find new coordinates because Skippy, you want to TP there because I, I can't TP yeah. to enemy territory oh, or whatever. Farm. So here we go. Uh, Skippy's teleporting there. I'm going to TP to yeah. Skippy here. Boom. And as you guys can see. Um, what a disaster. It's a disaster. It's an absolute. It's a, it's a it's a disaster. Uh, but and, the, and, and it happened what like, what like probably like literally like I recorded I recorded the first. Uh, oh, I got I just got like four more stacks of carrots because it was inside that hopper. Um, but anyway, <laughs> so I recorded that like a three minutes at the beginning of this episode, right? And I was like, yeah, you know, I spent some time today making this thing and blah blah blah. And then literally, like I I go and stream for like five hours, which I guess it was five hours, so it was quite a long time. But I go and stream for like five hours, and then, bam, this. Like, I literally was like, Skippy, did you see the new farm that I made? And he's like, no, I didn't. And then he goes to it, and then it's like, yeah, it was raided. And I was, like, like, oh. I was like, Nick, what is this? This is So terrible. anyway, yeah, this is a terrible farm. How are we supposed <laughs> to grow anything here? But uh, anyway, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do slash uh, back next year. And um, I'm going to do say hi to you, to 
There we go. Uh, but anyway, so pretty much this is what we have here, and uh, it's gonna be pretty good. So Skippy, if you want to go through here, I'm gonna I'm gonna go through all my stuff. Uh, I'm gonna do slash set home farm. Yeah, farm, boom, and then I'm gonna go back to the home. Uh, I actually want to get all of this, uh, this stuff. So we're, I have, I have a stack of. Um, oh, we do have some carrots in, in here. Uh, where's, where's my other? I had there. So here's, here's the, the other carrots that we had in here. I just, oh, I just threw some in there. Yeah. Uh, so those are only a little bit of the ones that we had. So um, there we go. There we go. There we go. So the one that you made was it automated? Uh, no, I didn't automate it. So that was that was sort of that that was sort of that issue. Um, also, for those of you wondering, that wooden axe was for world edit, but not for the farm. We are doing. I just realized how bad that looks now. <laughs> was for world edit, not for the farm. I'm not one of those guys. Don't worry about it. Uh, so anyway, that that was for that was for the that was for world edit at spawn. So I had to, I did change some stuff at spawn. But anyway, point being, now we can we can go. Oh wait wait wait. wait. So what do we need? What do we need? So first things first. I'm the realist. We're gonna want to we're gonna want to keep these chests on us. We're going to throw those in because we're not gonna need that. I want to empty my inventory so that we can. Do that. So we we want to automate this. That's that's the goal. We want to automate this. But right now what we're gonna do is we're actually just going to empty it with our fortune. The last time we're going to use Skippy, the last time we're going to use our Fortune 55 picks, because we're going to get rid of them after this, because they were never oh. supposed to be here. Funeral. We're going to have a funeral we're after gonna this. We're going to have a funeral, but we are going to use them one last time. One last time. We really need to organize this base. Yeah, we do. Starboy blew it up. That's that's what he came on and told us. He was like, Starboy's like, yeah, I blew up our base. Sorry, guys, I was testing to see if creepers, you know, would blow up our base or something silly. And I was like, well, Starboy, did you just just listen to what you just said? Listen to what you just said. <laughs> I was like, why why our base? Why our why base? Not like, else's why not base? not even just somebody else's base? Like, why not just why not just go and and place a creeper in in someone else? like in not even somebody else's base, but like some other faction claim? Like, it's not like you can't do it. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I just got an entire inventory full of carrots from using that fortune pick. Okay, I have your items. You want me okay. to put them in uh, yeah. somewhere? Yeah, throw, throw them in the chest. Okay, got boom. Boom. There we go. So there we go. We're getting those. And, and the water, right? Uh, Did the you need water? water? Yeah, we needed uh, eight buckets of water. All right, yep. Eight exactly nice. in there, I think. Nice. Um, and then a lever. So anyway, we're going to get these going here. So I need to figure out exactly where I want to place. Whoops. Uh, so the reason why we're doing this, so you guys might be saying, Nick, well, you know, in the new tools kit, you have, you know, Fortune 5 picks. Why wouldn't you just continue using a Fortune 5 pick? The reason for that being, uh, very simply, that this is actually going to end up being more efficient for the reason that if we set this up to a hopper clock, uh, and not the traditional hopper clock that you guys are thinking, not a, hop a hopper pulse generator, if you guys know what, you know, if you guys even know what I'm talking about. Um, but uh, pretty much, uh, and I'm going to have to make sure that this pattern works, but uh, if you want, if you want Skipper really? to start using your Fortune 55 and just start going through and, and just eliminating, like, all of these carrots and then just replanting them, that'd be great. Um, yeah, well, don't even slippers. Don't even bother replanting them, actually. Just go and break all of them. Uh, also, here you go. Take this. Take this. So take those, and uh, I, I'll actually start down here so that you can actually start working placing the chests. But uh, we're probably going to need a few more hoppers just so that we can expand and have, like, a ton of, of uh, you know what I mean? Like, you know how, uh, like, a, an iron golem thing has, like, a ton of chests at the bottom so that I can hold yep. a ton of items? Same deal. We want to do that. Um, right. Anyway, so we're going to break that. And then there we go. And then we're going to... Oh no. Oh no. What? Oh what no. Oh, oh no. Lava. Not, good. not good. Oh Coming. no. Oh, I have no blocks. I got slabs. it. I placed, I placed uh, dispensers and saved it. <laughs> and then I broke it again. Oh, I have slabs here if you need them. There we go. So we are, we're going to need to break in there and we're going to need to fix that. Because that's I'm gonna, I'll go around. Here we go. Sorry if I'm not the most energetic and my voice is a little bit raspy. I just did the five hour, like a five hour UHC stream with Mr. Oh. Tommy Tommy Tomahawk. And, uh, and yeah, that wasn't wasn't the most fun thing. Well, it was fun, but it was like, it was oh, I'm going to get trapped. Uh, <laughs> I, I just I just covered up all the lava to make it. Obscene. I know I was back there. Oh, 
Okay, you go I like going around. Yeah, yeah, I got out, I got out. Okay. Okay, so anyway, uh, I'm gonna pick up that dispenser there, and we are going to place the chests back here. But yeah, so uh, also that reminds me, if you guys want to watch the 24-hour live stream, it's gonna be happening this Saturday, depending on when you're watching this. Hopefully, you guys are watching this when it happens. If you guys aren't, then make sure you guys go check. Maybe there's gonna be another 24-hour live stream when you're watching this. But uh, anyway, we're gonna grab that glowstone. We're gonna place that there so that it keeps the. So anyway, the, the cool thing about glowstone, if you guys didn't know, is that glowstone you guys can actually do this with. So even though it's a solid block, you can actually still open like open chests into it. And the even cooler part is just the fact that uh, it, it still affects blocks normally. So again, pretend this is our this is our carrot, right? So this little golden apple is our carrot. It's going to go and it's going to get sucked into the hopper and then we can still open this guy and pull, pull it out. So anyway, that's true. Um, so for those of you wondering, um, I don't exactly know if this is 100% the most efficient way. I just know it is really efficient um, because basically it mean it's it, it'll give us a ton of chests. Anyway, uh, so we are going to grab these and then basically all you guys all you have to do is just do that. There we go. And then there we go. So now that top chest is gonna fill up from the main hopper, and as that and fills up, it's going to disperse. yeah, it's gonna go from bottom to top. So it's oh. going to fill up from bottom to top, which is quite convenient. And you can open up all of these. And then say we wanted to go down a little bit further. Um, yeah, all yeah. We can need... we go down more? Uh, I think we can go down one more. Which is actually... Oh, no. I broke that by accident. No. Okay. Sorry. Oh, I got that. it. I'll fix it. Uh, and then boom, boom. And then boom, boom. And then we can go like that. That's not right. Like that. Is that right? That's not right. You want to make sure that it's going into the chest. All right. Back up. Back up. Back up, Skippy. There we go and just move over there we go so yeah that's that's right. how it works so basically now we just want to make stairs getting out of here it's so hard when you have like such a high it's a, that's a yeah, such a, that's like... a such a first world problem dude the efficiency <laughs> on my pick is too high you know <laughs> it's too it's too high here anyway um so that that should work and then that'll disperse it throughout all of those and then we'll do the same thing on the other side so feel free now to use your fortune uh 55 pick and kind of go nuts mm. on all these and then okay. you uh, basically can throw them into this water stream. So after you're done, so you know if your inventory fills up, you can basically throw them into the water stream, and uh, they'll get sucked up into the chests, and we'll empty them later. Sound good? Yep. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna connect this with this one over here, just so that we can access both. So when we go like this, so basically they're all gonna really? start. They're all gonna start jumping. Okay. So they're all, they're, when they all corner. start jumping, so if you you wanna move mm -hmm. for a second. Um, so if we go like something like that, they're all gonna start jumping when they when they all enter the hopper. Um, okay, well there wasn't. Okay, you throw all yours. Throw all yours. So they're they're not gonna get sucked in, and then as as the other ones are unfilled, it'll slowly go. Then and they'll then, fill and up. Yeah, and then they'll go to the middle where they'll start jumping up when uh, it's completely full. But that means that if each hopper is uh, five stacks, that means we have one, two, three, four, five, six stacks per one of these and if one of these is one quarter of 600 which is be 150 uh we should be good we should be good um so yeah i'm hoping i'm crossing my fingers here but uh it should work it should work out let's see if make sure it's it's actually getting dropped in here oh yeah i forgot the buckets of water in here the buckets of water were still in that chest um <laughs> okay we're running back this way i need to I'll set up the chests on this side because the chest on this side isn't isn't figured out yet. So, uh, so do they like fall in one at a time or stacks at a yes, time? Yes, they they still they st when the hopper spits them out, it only does it one uh, one item at a time. But uh, so basically, they go no, into the. I mean, the, like yep. when they're getting collected. Oh. Oh, I just threw my bow in there. When oh you when you drop items into a hopper, the entire stack goes in all at once. So the oh, hopper okay. takes things in at one one stack at a time, but it only spits them out one item at a time. Make sense? Yeah, yeah. So like if you drop a stack of carrots there, then they're they're all gonna get absorbed super quick. That's why yeah, that's why it's really all good. All of have these hoppers on this side are full. Yeah. So they're piling up in the middle again. Um, well, again, like we we dropped like we're dropping because of our fortune 55 We're dropping way more uh, carrots than are ever actually going to be in there. Oh So it's just right now then yeah, it's just right now it's like there's never gonna be we're never gonna have uh, like You know, what are we dropping like 20 stacks in at once? Yeah, yeah, we're not gonna have that We're gonna have 
you know, 600. We're going to have probably 30 stacks. This entire farm is going to output like 30 stacks uh, at once. So in one yield, we'll get 30 stacks, which is going to be, you know, we'll, we'll be perfectly fine. Uh, yeah, if you want, just start, you can just start throwing uh, the carrots into like either of any of the hoppers really, and it'll, they'll get spit into appropriate sort of item or appropriate chests. All right. Okay. And then, yeah, I think we're good. Oh. I think we're good. So basically the reason why I wanted to make sure that we broke them all with our fortune picks first is because when I start putting dispensers up here, I might break it. So I'll not break it, but yeah. I might spit out water by accident. And if I do that, um, all the carrots go away. So some of this first. Wow, wow. I have 64 redstone. Why did you even need to give me redstone blocks? Uh, <laughs> I literally had 64 redstone in my inventory and I don't need much more than that. There we go. And we are going to place this going around the back. I'm probably just going to end up making a button because a button's going to be better for this use case anyway. Mm hmm Just because we want it to turn on and then off really quick. Yeah, 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 I see. And... So if we use a lever, would it just, like, stay on? It would on stay on. Until yeah, we turn until it we, off. Until we flip it. So the benefit of that being that we're, we're positive, it's always, like, it's always going to... Like, it'll stay on until we turn... Ah, eh, we might actually want to put a lever then. Just because if we put a lever, it'll like we can keep the water stream on until all the the, the um, carrots have been pushed to the bottom. Mm -hmm. There we go. And let's throw one of the buckets in there. Throw another oh. bucket in there. Oh, damn it. And <laughs> throw one bucket in there. And slash home space. Home. There we go. And grab that. And slash back. And then we're gonna place this in here. I think that's it. Is that it? Is that it? Yeah. So anyway, um, are you ready? Are you ready? Right. Ready for what? Oh, is it gonna work? Hopefully. I'm crossing my fingers. Oh. Do I need to plant some to test? Or no, no. We'll just. There's not very many left. Oh no! I forgot oh. about a repeater. I kind of need a repeater. Oh, it did work though. Okay, that's cool. So it worked, it covered 100% of it. Is all the carrots going down to the bottom? Yep. Okay. Uh, they're all kind of stacked up right now. I have a feeling we're gonna lose a lot to clear like here in a little bit. What happened? Is it like- No, it's, it's, reloading. it's reloading. It's reloading. Damn it. Hashtag just... blame Scotty 2K15. Uh... Uh, going to the top. Dispenser, redstone, redstone repeater. There we yeah. go. Wow, I got 16 of them. Back. Yeah, great, great deals at the shop. Yeah, great, great deals. A hundred for a hundred dollars for sixteen redstone repeaters. It's better than having to go like source all the stone and stuff yourself. Do you know how to make a redstone repeater? Uh, kind of. How do you make a redstone repeater? Oh, like craft a redstone yep. repeater? No clue. <laughs> exactly. Bet you most people don't. Uh, it's a redstone torch, and then it's like three stone or something. It's weird. Yeah, I just rely Wait, on. Wait, why, uh, why is this on? Shops. Why is this? Because the lever's down. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I was like, I was like, what? Um. <laughs> anyway, so hopefully that, hopefully this works. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Moment of truth. Is that all of them? You even got the yep, end one. Yep. Okay, yep. Cool. Nice. So it got all of them, and then you flip the switch again, and it, they all go away. That is sweet. So basically, the idea is that we're gonna connect that input to a um, we're gonna Timer? connect this input to a hopper clock. So not the hopper clock that turns oh. it on and off, on and off, on and off really fast, but a hopper clock that'll turn it on and off about every 15 minutes. So basically, every 15 Ooh. minutes, it'll turn it on and then go back off. That's complicated. Um, it is gonna be complicated, mainly because yeah. uh, we're going to need to turn it, like we're gonna need to pulse it. And then 15 minutes, and then pulse it again. So we're gonna need to pulse it, pulse it again, and then 15 minutes later, pulse it again, pulse it. Again. Like it's gonna, because basically it needs to, yeah. it needs to shoot out all this water and then suck it back in. Shoot out all the water, suck it back in. Uh, yeah, so I anyway, see, that's see. that's what we're doing here. So again, we have like 600 and something plots because this is 16 times seven times six. The other thing that we can do is we can get a mob grinder and get a pico farm going if you want to. But uh, anyway. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode of Op Factions. We're going to end this with a... You want to do a crate key? 
You wanna do a crate oh, key? Oh yeah, Mr. we gotta do a crate key. Slash key. Oh no, that we have them at the, we have them back at home. So slash home space home. Uh, go ahead and grab and one here. There we go. And then we're gonna do slash spawn. 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 There we go. And oh, wrong way. Wrong way. I always turn the I always turn to the right, and then I turn to the right three times, and then I finally get the right <laughs> direction. Uh, anyway, three, two, one, click. Boom. Here we go. Going for. Red I'm gonna or go purple. for a dark blue. I'm gonna be conservative. Dark blue? I'm going for I want dark purple. Blue. But I mean, I think I'm thinking purple, but I really want red. Oh. Oh, I got oh, white I almost got again. First. I almost got for white again. Oh wow! I should have emptied my inventory. Please don't give me a kit. Please don't give me a kit. Oh, I got haste. Oh, I got kit build. That's oh. not good. That's not good. Uh, I I can pick it up. I can pick it up. Wham. Okay, cool. Oh, wham. 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 Anyway, I just I just wanted to make sure we got the obsidian. Anyway, let's go back wham. home, throw this stuff oh, down. Wham. Uh for those of you watching this now, you guys will most likely be able to purchase um if you guys want to buy crate keys, you'll be able to buy them from the shop. I think we're setting them at uh three dollars for five or five dollars for ten. And uh you guys will be able to get them and use them and you can auction them off even if you feel like it and all that sort of stuff. But uh anyway, hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode. Make sure you slam that like button down below, subscribe to the nation, check out all the other faction episodes, and by all the other ones, I mean the one other one that we did, uh and uh <laughs> all of the other stuff. So anyway, hopefully you guys did enjoy. I'm the doctor and I'm and that's Skippy. Bye. Bye.